Guys, I have this Dell Value 11 Pro 11 Pro 11 40 uh, uh, Pro this tablet and uh, it's made by Dell I really like it everything and Dell makes a very nice uh, charger for it and it's very compact and it's a 20 volt 19.5 volt and 1.2 amp it's by 20 watt uh, charger and it's great I love it by everything because uh, not only I can charge my tablet but I can charge any phone with it for a for five because it also gives five volt but Dell doesn't make any charger for the car so I looked it up and I couldn't find anything and other people suggested that the only option we have is buy something like these a power inverter and then use this charger to charge this in the car if I needed it uh, but uh, I didn't like this solution for one reason because uh, they are very bulky as you can see if I go this route I'll buy uh, one of these I like this one because it have uh, it's have a nice package casing and it got lots of uh, accessories uh, this one is a little bit smaller but again it's very bulky so I was looking for a better solution so why, what I ended up getting is since this is a 19.5 volt that we need uh, I went to this thing here and I bought this this is called the trigger rolled PD trigger USB PD trigger it's if we attach this to any um, PD charger, it will give us 20 volt, which is the right voltage to charge this. So I, if I have this, and here is what I did. I bought, I bought this, and I connected a USB port with it. You see, you have to connect the connections here. Oh, what did I do? Yeah, you have to connect the connectors here. So this is what I did. I put the connectors and I put the glue, hot glue on it, as you can see from the back. And I made this uh, custom belt uh, thing. Now, all I can do, I can connect this with my car charger, if I have a car charger with a USB wire. So on this way, it will go a USB wire. You can see this small tiny USB wire. On this side, I will connect it to my car charger. And this is the car charger that I choose, that I already purchased. This is the one. It is about for $8, it is about for $8 on uh, Amazon. And here's the specs for it. This is what you want. You want a USB PD charger, which gives 20 volt and 1.5 amp. It also gives a USB A port, which again, these are the specs 20 watt. So I needed something, as you can see, there are two ports on it. It have USB C and USB A. So if I connect this on the USB C port, and then I connect this at the end, I will get 20 volt here. So this is with these two things. I would have 20 volt outage combining with this. Got it? Now here's the, uh, the best part about it. If you don't want to do all this uh, voltage, uh, you know, the uh, soldering and everything, you can just buy another one, this one. It already comes with a USB-C port and USB-A port. So can you, just, you can just connect your USB-A wire directly here with your Dell. I didn't like it because it have a trigger switch in it where we select 5, 12, 15, uh, 20 volt and I didn't want it to do, you know, uh, I, I don't know if I have to every time click this button to get a 20 volt and I don't want it to bust my laptop. So that's why I bought this fixed one, uh, this fixed voltage, this is 20 volt straight. And I made this piece myself. Now, here's the best part about it. Not only I can connect this with a, a car charger like this, I can actually connect this with a power bank and power my laptop with this power bank. This is a PD power bank, as you can see on it. Now, oops. 
later. Okay, now I'm going to show you everything. Uh, and I have this uh, 20 volt USB. Uh, I have this USB tester voltage also. So I'm gonna put it all together and show you. Now look at this, look at this, my whole setup. Power bank, a small USB to USB-C wire, my homemade uh, wire, and then as you can see, it's showing 20 volt. Let me, 19.7 volt, 19.8, you see, we need 19.5, so it's perfect. And then a small USB A to micro USB. And I'm charging this with my power bank. Here, as you see, you see it's charging. Ta da! See, it's charging 18 minutes until fully charged. So, here's the best setup anybody could ever have. Just with this small piece of wire, I can charge it in my car or I can even charge it with my power bank. And as you can see, it's giving the voltage that it needs. Perfectly, a perfect setup. If you like this solution, press like, subscribe and share with everybody. We were looking for this solution for so long.